Native Tears here, and we have a mountain of mail calls. Um, so, yeah, I've got one, two, three, four, five, four packages and one envelope. So, let's get to it. Okay, y'all. Um, these first two I got before we went on the road trip and we're supposed to go camping. And anyways, that got, that uh, came to an abrupt halt. Um, and we had to turn around and beeline for home. And uh, I was extremely broken hearted and upset and uh, it was a miserable ride back home. So anyways, this first piece of mail, two pieces, um, this is from Wallace Vivian up in Newfoundland, and this is from Minnesota, and like I said, I got these two before I went out of town, so I'm going to open these first. I was going to open them up there while we were camping, and well, that didn't happen. Yeah. It is so hot. Oh, I was enjoying the pleasant weather we had up there. And yes, I'm using my pink shade. Oh. Let's see if we have a letter. And it says, Thank you for the parcel you sent. Here's something back. Love your channel. Want to thank you for all the support on my channel. Hope your garden is growing good. Take care. All the best. Wallace Vivian. Um, Thank you, and uh, actually, when I, I just went out and picked some stuff in the garden, I had a handful of baby romas, a couple yellow tomatoes, my lemon boys, and two huge zucchini. Now, when we left, and we were only gone, mind you, what was it, like 72 hours maybe, they were this big, and I'll put a picture in at the end of the video how big. They were huge and two days. This is 3D. This is cool. This is a coaster. And I don't know if the 3D will come through on that. That is very cool. It looks like the whale is jumping out of it. That's really cool. I have to get a picture and insert that. More goodies in here. Oh, he packed this full. Oh. Hey, amen. I need a lanyard. Awesome. And it is, even has for the cell phone. Yay. Newfoundland. Oh, such good goodies. Ah. I can't believe the difference in the weather up north. I just, I'm sitting here and have sweat dripping off of me. And up there, we almost needed jackets at this time of day and a key ring that is really cool and it spins oh that's awesome yay I love it all oh and you didn't have to do that that's super cool thank you get it all back in here so that it makes it inside I'll get the sticker on my board. Um, this next one, I know who this is from. This is Outlaw Edge Blade Works, Outlaw Customs, up in Minnesota. I'd sent him one of my stickers because I'd wanted one of his. Yep, yep. Check them out. I hope these are right side and not backwards again why my camera keeps going backwards Let's see if there's nope no letter in there so uh outlaw customs minnesota go check them out i have a link down below um outlaw edge blade works 
and uh, bushcraft. Um, he's got a pr couple pretty funny videos on there. Um, fixing a Ford. Yeah. Um, he did a day hike, him and his girl. And they went to a super awesome car show. Oh my gosh, there was over 20,000 cars registered in this car show. What a great time. Holy cow, just fabulous. So I thank you for the stickers back. That's awesome. They're going to go on my board. Um, the next one I got the day after I left. And uh, my buddy was trying to be... And uh, my buddy was trying to be so helpful. He saw my VR, the bearded CB, that I uh, really needed that hammock. Um, so this comes all the way from San Antonio. It's Texas. It's our crypto man um, hiking and bushcraft, um, Raymond. He does all the gear reviews, excellent gear reviews. Um, I have a link for him too, but out of the kindness of his heart, he sent me, I'll, I'll wait and let you see what he sent me, so that was just super awesome, and I told him I could send it back to him since we were already up there, or I could do a pay it forward, and he said that he sent it for me to use. So, let's see what all we have in here. Do we have some Yes. Hope you enjoy the hammock and all the other stuff I sent. Have a nice, safe camping trip. Your friend Raymond. P.S. The headlamp I sent you is USB rechargeable. <gasps> How cool is that? Oh, check it out. Tuck in. The uh, high mode is 120 lumens at 80 meters of distance. The burn time is 10 hours. And the floodlight is 20 lumens. A uh, distance of 16 meters for 180 hours. And then, yeah, it has a strobe on it also. How cool is that? You know, and I never have enough headlamps. There we go. I can't wait to get it on and charge it up and test it out. I like gardening at night because it's a lot cooler and uh, the bees aren't as bad at night time. So there it is, friends, and I'm going to take it inside and plug it in and charge it up and I'll start using this right away. Not just for camping. Oh, wow. That's really cool. Oh my gosh. But there's more. This is straps. Okay, this goes with this is the straps goes with the hammock. And paracord beaner compass. Oh my gosh, really? Guys, guys. Check it out. It's like my car to handles. Toe knife. And that is sweet. What a sweet little knife. <laughs> That's awesome, and I love the nice size hole on it for some good heavy cordage. Wow. What else? What else? Oh, oh, oh. And a sticker. Yay! 
Dude, we love our stickers, right? We love our stickers. Crypto Man, hiking and bushcraft. He's got a cool sticker. I can't wait to get that on my board. Did I get everything? Yay. You are so awesome. Oh my gosh. And just goes to show how wonderful the people in this community are. Um, didn't ask for a hammock and he just saw my VR and out of the goodness of his heart he sent me a hammock for my camping trip. Sadly, our day leaving kept changing, kept changing, kept changing. And we left a day early and it was at the post so it came to my house um, just as we were arriving up there um, mom had called and said I had a package and Raymond called me just as we were pulling on to the Sisseton the reservation we were on the main strip going right through downtown uh, so yeah it's all about timing um, the timing on this trip was just, the timing was great. It was everything else that happened was not so great. <coughs> Murphy's Law follows me. Um, now this next one I got. And I got two packages yesterday. This is from Rick over Tack Hill, my Viking brother. And get her open. And as you all know, he picked up some super cool exotic woods. And uh, he said he was going to send me some. Which I told him he didn't have to do that. That wood was for him to make some really super cool handles. Because, you know, he's really good at his handles. And uh, he's got all the nice equipment he can do to saw them and sand them with a belt sander and power sander. And he can cut them and glue them together. And he's got the clamps and vise. And I don't have any of that. That's why I just use the branches and I whittle them down. And I'm opening and I can't open my hands, they're not working. Hang on. Oh guys, this wood is awesome. I just hope the camera does it justice. Said, hey D, what's up? Here's some exotic wood for your handles. Hope it helps you along on your masterpieces. Rick from Tack Hill. Let me show you first. Paduck, Paduck wood, and it is an orange color. So uh, that's Paduck. This one is Granadillo. It's got some really nice graining in that. Probably because I'm sitting here in the shade, you're not going to be able to see the graining. And this is the beauty of all beauties. This is Purple Heart. And it is purple. I will uh, take a picture in the sun and put it in at the end. Boy, I sure wish I had a power saw where I could saw these in some vices, vice clamps, C clamps. So I could make some really pretty stuff. So yeah, that's super awesome, Rick. Thank you. And uh, I can't wait to experiment with them and see if I can't make something as cool as what you do. Um, I have a link down below to Rick also. Everybody that I'm opening this mail from, I can't believe how much mail there was for me while I was gone. Um, I will have 
links down below, so please be sure to go. I got guys. <laughs> you know our our buddy Jimmy Slash, um, who does all the wonderful pay it forwards. Well, this was sitting in my mailbox. We went out today and got the mail that was from yesterday. Um, this is from Jimmy Slash. All I can think of is that he found out it was my birthday and he's sending me a birthday present. So let's get into this and see. Mr. Jimmy Slash. Oh guys, did you see the my new logo? Do you like that? Um, Rick also was messing around with some of the designs I picked out and some he's done on his own. Um, so we're trying to get me a logo so I can get me some official stickers from my official channel. Love mosquito. Oh, oh, oh. We have some, oh looks like glow-in-the-dark paracord and some OD green <laughs> black cherry blow pops he always puts candy in yum yum sour apple and bubble gum two of my favorites and this cherry and another black cherry oh yay I love suckers What do we have? Gas Monkey Garage Key Ring Knife. It's a uh, frame lock design, ultra lightweight. It's one ounce. One handed open, one handed closed design. There's also a key ring, a pocket clip, and a thumb stud blade opener. Very cool. You know, he didn't put a note in here. I was going to open this. And I'm going to open it. But I saw what was in this one. <coughs> it is a Gonzo. This is model G738BK. Oh, oh, oh. Looky there. You know that orange one that was in my pay it forward? I really thought was awesome. But check this one out. I have a Gonzo. And like other Gonzos, they come with its own little pouch. It's a little velvet pouch. Let's see here what this says. Four forty steel. Made in China, Gonzo Tools Company L T D. And it's got the Gonzo on the blade. Sweet. Sweet. And you know it's not real heavy. And I can change the pocket clip to this side or that side. Very nice to so be a lefty or a righty. Wow. Mr. Jimmy Slash, you outdid yourself again, as always. You the bladed angel sending smiles all over. Um, Thank you so much. I gotta get into this one. Um, this video is really long and I apologize, but we had, had five, six pieces of mail here and they were all super cool and they were all packages. So, you know, we have to... Oops, I dropped it. Dropped a key ring. Check it out. Check it. Oh, look at that one. Yeah. Now talk about tiny. 
Fuck yes. <laughs> yeah, I might be able to fit some paracord through there. <coughs> so that I can put that around my neck, but you know what? I'll find something really good. Excellent size for putting in the pocket. So that's really cool. So I got a gonzo and I got a gas monkey. Guess what that was called? A gas monkey? Yep, gas monkey garage. Key ring knife. And here's the ring. So I want to thank all of you for the super awesome mail, Rick, um, Mr. Wallace, Vivian, um, up in Minnesota, Outlaw Edge Blade, Blade Works, Bushcraft, um, go check him out, and, uh, see Tack Hill and Vivian Wallace, Wallace Vivian, Mr. Jimmy Slash, um, I'll have everybody down below so you can check them out. This video is 20 minutes long, and I apologize. I try to do short ones, and then, you know, every once in a while, those long ones seem like I can't avoid them, and this mail call was too good to, to bust up, and I just think uh, we have the greatest community. Uh, super awesome late birthday, and uh, thank you all. Hope y'all are doing good wherever you are and hope you're having a safe weekend. Canada's 150th, Sisseton and Wapadon's 150th, and uh, America, America, United States' is Independence Day is Tuesday. So everybody's celebrating all weekend long. So wherever you are celebrating, um, hope you are celebrating safely. Don't drink and drive. If you drink, drink responsibly, please, and uh, don't get hurt. Have fun. I'm out of here. Remember, thank our veterans. Um, remember our veterans. And uh, remember our boys and girls deployed around the world who can't be home. They have tears is out. Bye.